everybody, Brickhouse here. Now, imagine this scenario. You're at the People's Choice Awards. The award for Action Star of the Year comes up. You've got Jason Momoa, expected. Tom Cruise, expected. Keanu Reeves, expected. Rachel Zegler, you know, weird, weird, weird. So those are your nominees. And the winner for Action Star of the Year is Rachel Zegler. What? Rachel Zegler? And of course, she gets up and says, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for this incredible honor. I am beyond grateful to be named Action Star of the Year. Cut to Tom Cruise. Hey, wait a minute. How did she win over us? Keanu Reeves, this is outrageous. We're the ones who have been in an action game for years. Rachel Zegler, sorry, boys. Looks like the tables have turned. Rachel Zegler, action star extraordinaire. So all to, you, to all you viewers out there, remember, sometimes the underdog comes out on top. Thank you for all your support. Now, that scenario isn't fantasy, it's reality. That's right. Somehow, some way, Rachel Zegler was named Action Star of the Year at the People's Choice Awards. Now, I'm just going to say it. I smell a rat. There is no way, no way that Rachel Zegler, who was the lead in the Hunger Games, the Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, is the people's choice for Action Hero of the Year. Especially when you look at Keanu Reeves, John Wick, Chapter 4. If you haven't seen it, watch it. It's awesome. Tom Cruise, Mission Impossible, Dead Reckoning, Part One. I guess there's not going to be a part new. They part two. They renamed it, but still, Mission Impossible. Jason Momoa, even though it's Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom. Well, you could also also say for Fast and Furious Ten or Fast X. The question is, uh, oh, before I forget, you also had Chris Pratt, Guardians of the Galaxy 3, Gal Gadot for her Netflix movie, uh, Queen of Hearts, or I forget what it was called. It was, a, it was a female James Bond movie, basically. I thought it was okay. I thought it was decent. Uh, Viola Davis, her co-star, was also nominated. And Brie Larson for the Marvels. So, how does this happen? Especially with all the anger and bitterness and, and people were just tired of Rachel Zegler. I mean, they talk about review bombing. They talk about, you know, all these different things done with algorithms and AI to uh, review bomb movies to prop up movies. Well, I think in this case, if you ask me, there was some shenanigans going on here with this People's Choice Award for Best Action Hero of the Year. So, it's my opinion, my opinion alone. I'm sure there are others out there that are saying the same thing, shaking their head going, Rachel Zegler, Action Hero of the Year? 
for action movie star of the year? What the hell? So I'll leave it up to you guys. Comment down below. Share your thoughts. What do you think happened? How how does Rachel Zegler win Action Hero of the Year at the People's Choice Award? Especially when we know the majority of people really don't like her. So while you're at it commenting, please take the time to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. And with that, I will see you later.